To prototype in the field, it's often easiest to piggyback on an existing infrastructure. To prototype for sustainability, this means the climate control system. Access usually involves destructive hacking, then hardware design and soldering. What if instead of hacking the electronics, we mechanically hijack the buttons? Instead of human hands, we could then use tiny robots to actuate the buttons, to raise the temperature and to lower the temperature. We call them robot pseudopods. And just a very basic vocabulary can hijack the pinch, poke, or twist of the human hand. With just these three widgets, you can extend the example to the car. Or if you're studying machine intelligence, hijack a Roomba. Tell it to go right. The pincher hijacks the left bumper. Perceiving an obstacle, the Roomba turns right. The poker hijacks the power button, telling the robot when to start and stop. We explained mechanical hijacking to two middle school classes. Each created a Ubicomp prototype in four hours. They used pseudopods to hijack the buttons on the remote control and use sound to trigger the response.